know that slime is a lot of fun. It's gooey, it's messy and it's slimy. But actually, there's a lot more going on behind slime. Today, I'm in the S4 classroom and we're going to be learning about the science behind slime. And we're going to be showing you how you can make your very own slime while helping save the planet. When we make slime, we're doing polymer science. And scientists use this to make everything from nappies to the paint on your walls. Now, to help us understand this a little bit more, we've got with us our very own S4's physicist, Dr. Christie. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hi. What is a polymer? Sure, so a polymer is a long chain of molecules. So a polymer comes from the Greek word meaning many, and it's many repeated molecules over and over again in a long chain. How does this relate to our slime? So when you make a slime, we usually start with a polymer, and we add something called an activator, which will take the chains of the polymer and join them together in random places. Okay. And that will hold it all together and also makes it quite stretchy ah, like this. Like our slime. Exactly, but if you've ever played with slime again, you'll know what happens if you stretch it too fast. So if you, it yeah, grab onto that side. <gasps> Whoa, oh my and gosh, there you go. It's, if, you, if you pull it too fast, it snaps and it breaks. Can we make our own slime and see this? Yeah, sure, let's make our own slime. Let's do it. First of all, we're going to start with some PVA glue. So if you'd right. like to pour some of that in our bowl. I would. I'm excited <laughs> to make slime. So actually, what is PVA? So PVA is our polymer. It's polyvinyl acetate. It is a liquid uh, plastic. So its molecules are arranged in these long chains like we saw before. What else do we have with this? So next of all, we're going to have some food colouring. Okay. So this doesn't, it doesn't do anything apart from it gives it a nice blue colour. So you can do whatever colour you yeah, want. I like blue. So we're going okay. blue. All right. And then start mixing. Give that a good stir for me. Yeah. Okay. The next thing we're going to add is a little bit of baking soda. Okay. Now, why baking soda? I really associate baking soda with cakes and yummy things that I make in the kitchen. Yeah, in your cakes it mixes with the acid in the cake mixture, so baking soda itself is a alkali. Okay. So there's a neutralisation reaction there and carbon dioxide is released, little bubbles. Okay. And that's what makes your cakes nice and light and fluffy. So what I'm going to do now is add our last ingredient, okay. our activator. This is another liquid, it's a laundry detergent. Um, but it's got an acid in it, similar to boric acid. Okay, so this um, is where we're going to see the change. Yeah, is this it? is our activator. Mm -hmm. So what this does, the acid in this laundry detergent, it grabs those uh, polymers in the PVA, makes them grab onto each other at random. It's like those rubber bands we saw earlier. Okay. It's going to make it hold all those polymers together. And because it's changing the structure... It is changing the structure! <laughs> of the oh passport. Yeah, you're getting a bit of a phase transition. It's okay, so is this making a liquid into a solid? Not quite. Have you ever played with anything like oobleck? Yes, or, yeah. Yeah, yeah. so it, for those who don't know, it's when you mix cornstarch and water. Okay. And what you get at the end isn't a liquid and it's not a solid. It's both, depending on how you play with it. And we call ah. this a non-Newtonian fluid. And this is what we're getting yeah. here with our slime. So <gasps> if we leave it in the bowl, it'll flow and it'll take the shape of a bowl, just like a liquid. Okay. But if we pick it up and play with it, you can see, ah. it in my hand. And slime! How amazing, we've just made slime as easy as that. Now, there is a bit of a concern though, because we've just made non-Newtonian fluid using plastic. Everybody knows how bad plastic is for our environment. Yes. Mm. So there are a few things you can do to kind of help, help out the situation. Is there anything else I can do? Yes, you can actually make a biodegradable slime which has no plastic in it at all. Oh, I want to make that. <laughs> Let's make that. <laughs> So we need some food colouring, a bowl of psyllium husk. Psyllium husk, okay. Brand new ingredients there. What is psyllium husk? So the psyllium husk comes from the plantago plant, which is a tropical plant, and it's sold as a fibre supplement in most health food shops and a few supermarkets, and it comes to this weird looking brown powder. Mm, can I smell it? You can. Mm. So if you'd like to pop oh, a really nice. heat tablespoon okay, of that go, into our beaker, it. let's get okay. going. Okay. That's in. What next? So I want you to measure out a cup of water. Okay. Don't add it in quite yet though. Right. And I want you to add in the food colouring to the water because okay. it'll mix into there a bit better than after we've added it to the psyllium husk. Right, that's it. Shall I give it a stir? Give it a stir. Give it a careful stir. stir. Careful stir so it doesn't <laughs> spill everywhere. <Yes. laughs> okay. So as you add the water in and you stir it, you'll start to see the water change. It'll become much, Ooh. much thicker. Okay. Almost like, have a look, it becomes almost like a gel. Oh, yeah. So everything in there is edible. Oh my gosh, yeah, so Shall I give it a go? Give it a taste. I can't believe I'm doing this. <laughs> Here we go. Hmm. <laughs> so it tastes a bit like soil. It is edible, but it's kind of, it tastes a bit like soil. Oh, remember this is a fibre supplement meant for adults. So don't go eating this at home 
and definitely never ever ever eat any slime made out of PVA and that includes you as well. Yeah, that is a big <laughs> no-no. Oh my gosh, look at that! <laughs> that is some serious slime. What we've got is this lovely gelatinous, oh. messy kind of slime. And the best thing about this is we've just made environmentally friendly slime, completely biodegradable. If you like this video, make sure you share, comment, like and subscribe for more.